Okay, this is Dennis's Revo. See that, see that black smoke? That's how dirty it is, huh? It's cleaning. It's cleaning the engine. With this. Here's the PWM. PWM's running at 20 amps. 20 amps. Yeah. Finished to start. It should start stay to that way. <laughs> Unless you adjust it. You prefer running it at 20 amps. Safety features on the PWM. Mm -hmm. So the safety features on this PWM. What we incorporate here. Uh, all right. Uh, here's our master switch for our PWM. PWM's down there. Car's off. Let's start her up. Okay, diesel. We just start her up, and we'll hit the master switch for the PWM. Got a red light. And PWM's down here. There's the fan. I don't know. If it's not moving, and we got no amperage, so we'll just hit this little push button right here, and bam, we got 20 amps, baby, all day long. All day long. Yep, all day long, it's dead 20 amps. Now, the built-in safety feature is nice. I can forget to turn off the master switch and just turn off the ignition and walk away, but there's a residual charge, so we're gonna have to wait 40 seconds, okay? You're gonna have to suffer with me. It's the only way I can prove it. So it started right about there. So 40 seconds should be way over here. Okay, we'll just give it. I want to be safe. Exactly like a because we, if we don't wait for the residual charge to dissipate, then if we try to just turn the ignition switch back on, the fan and the PWM will start back up. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we have to let the residual charge go. Almost there. I don't know if you see that second hand, but it's coming around. All right, let's say we got 40 seconds right there. So now we can start it back up with the, the master switch is still here, still in the on position. I just turned the ignition on, and you can see the master switch is still in the on position. But the fuel cell did not come on. Okay? How do you like that? Now, even if I turn 
the, the truck on. There, the fuel cell's still off. I have to restart the button again. Okay. And then, if I really want to, as I'm going down the highway, I can turn it off manually right here. I don't have to turn off the car. So it doesn't matter if it's on or off. If I want to kill the engine with this in the on position, I can leave it like that forever. In the morning I start up, now I just push my butt and on the way. End of story.